have to hand it to the director. He does have style. Well, he is the big boss of an evil organization. He'd almost have to. Evil organization, huh? <sighs> Somebody seems awfully out of it right now. <sighs> that damn bureau is nothing but a waste of government money. We're all you need to keep Akihabara safe, damn it. Where's Saki? She went home. Yep, she's gone. Mizuki and Aoi saw her off at the station. Saki Saki didn't even remember my name. Man. I think that's enough fraternizing for one day. Time you guys and us guys parted ways. But... It's okay, Asahi. Calm down. Go. It'll all be fine. Just calm down. Wow, this is a rarity. If you'll be excusing us then. Mm, before I go, though, I gotta thank you for granting Saki's wish. We owe you there. Goodbye. <laughs> I heard about Saki. She didn't even remember me. She awoke from her dream. After all this time, there's still so much we don't know. But you do. What are delusions, really? <laughs> Just freaking tell us already, you old git! You were in the DAB yourself, weren't you? You gotta know! <sighs> Guess there's no sense hiding it anymore. Yeah, I was indeed part of the Bureau. Up until three years ago, anyway. At that time, I was in charge of making a visualization device for the delusions. Visualization device? There's something to allow the general public to recognize delusions as delusions. Just couldn't quite get it right, though. Back then, the only delusion that had a hold on me was the delusion called work. I devoted myself to it every day. So, what changed? Why'd you give it up? Simple. I got fed up with it. That's all there is to it. Huh? Once you kids enter the workforce, you'll understand. There are times we adults just can't take it anymore. So, you got a handle on who I really am now, or what? No, because I don't think you're telling us the whole truth. Mari Tojo was the person you were looking for, right? And you found her. So why are you still with us? I'm not looking for her so much as I'm looking for an answer. And that, I haven't found yet. Still don't get it. One day you will. But for now, that's all the info you're getting out of me. After all, I'm doing all the talking here. There's one among our number who hasn't said a word. <laughs> you seem pretty heartbroken, kid. It is true that we destroyed that girl's delusion. But if we hadn't, the Bureau would've. One way or another, the end result would've turned out the same. But I'm the one who pulled the trigger. Which means... Saki's memories are gone because of me. And that has to be pretty disquieting, I get it. You're in shock from collapsing the delusion. But it didn't seem like she forgot completely. I'm betting in time she might start to remember. Do you think she really can? With the right spark? Yeah. I think it could happen. But who's to say the things she'd remember would be happy? Now that her delusion's gone, I wouldn't put money on it. Are you stupid? Oh? She said she believed in you, right? Gave you permission to destroy her delusion? Yeah, but... She sacrificed her own delusion to keep the world safe, didn't she? The delusion contractor is still around. As long as that's the case, delusions will continue to spread. Then Hoshino's dream was all for nothing? <sighs> God, I can't even bear to look at you anymore. Asahi, come with me for a sec. Huh? Where? The castle delusion. Come on! Why are we here? We have a delivery to make. Excuse me? There's something I forgot about when I was in here before. So now, we're going to deliver it. What are you talking about? Just follow me. Hey, how deep are we going? Yeah, Cole. Saki's already... Trust me. That girl wouldn't just leave this place and be done with it. 
Are you saying Saki is in here? She had delusions on the brain. There's no way she'd go back to an ordinary life without putting up a hell of a fight. So, I'm going to tear her limb from limb. That's what I forgot to give her before. Saki? Huh? Saki! That's what I thought. Huh. You've got good instincts, little lady. Is this like a womanly bond or something? <laughs> Saki, don't you remember? It's me, Asahi. Unreliable old neat Asahi. I met you all yesterday, didn't I? Saki, it's Ryu. Don't you remember me? Um... Saki, it's me! The noble familiar bound to your family line, Pinkoon! I'm sorry, strange stuffed animal. Yeah, this makes sense. After all, we did destroy her delusion. Let's just go. But... Saki... Well, now it's my turn. I come bearing gifts, you bitch! Uh... Ko, stop. Saki doesn't remember anything about what happened. Forgetting it so easily is an equally grave offense. Look, she doesn't remember trying to nullify your delusion, nor does she remember trying to be friends with you. Then I'm just going to have to smack the memories back into her head! <sighs> Damn it, Ko! Sonata! What was that? What did you throw at her? The thing I forgot to deliver. Huh? Asahi, look. There at Saki's feet. Huh? What is this? A notebook? Hm. Not like you to keep a diary. Wait, seriously? Saki, please. Read that book. Um... Today I encountered my first delusion. I think I might be some kind of chosen one. I was a little scared at first, but I think I'm okay now. And to top it all off, I made a new friend. He doesn't seem to have a name, so I'm going to recommend the name Pinkun, since he's pink and all. I hope he likes it. Pinkun? The one and only. Do you remember now? Akihabara sure is rife with delusions. It doesn't seem like we'll ever be able to get rid of them all. But I met someone new today. He's a neat, so I'm not sure how reliable he is, but at least he believes me. I hope he and I become fast friends. Asahi? Do you remember now? An idol themed delusion has appeared in town, but it's not the only one. Another new delusion has begun encroachment, too. But I've made another wonderful new friend. Her name is Ryu, and she's very cute. I hope she can teach me the secret to being so adorable. Ryu. That's me, all right. Ryu Momose. Yamato is one enigmatic boy. It almost seems like he doesn't want to destroy the delusion. But some things just have to be done. The safety of the world is at stake. I was glad he and I became friends, though, at least. Yamato. <laughs> Have I made a mistake? Should delusions not be nullified after all? What world am I trying to protect here? Do Katomi and I just live in completely different ones? I don't know. I just don't know anymore. Kotomi? Coming back to you yet? I am that Kotomi. The very Kotomi Sonata whose delusion you tried to crush. And I will not allow you to tell me you've forgotten who I am! I remember you. I do! I remember all of you, don't I? Yes, all of you. That's right! It's us! It's me! Saki, it's me! Pinkun, Asahi, Ryu, Yamato, Saki! This is no time to get emotional. Your diary cuts off there, doesn't it? Huh? 
It does. I know it does, because you dropped it. And you can't very well write in something you don't have. Then, after my last entry, what did I do? You betrayed your friends. What? You betrayed your friends and joined the Akihabara Freedom Fighters. You became our enemy. I... did? It doesn't matter anymore. Yes, it does! Do you think it's all right for her to simply forget why she defected? She could very well do it again, you know. That's... So I'm going to make her remember, one way or another. Prepare yourself, Saki! Huh? A few good kicks should jog your memory. So own up to your mistakes and face me! Wait! Let him fight it out. But... If I win... You have to answer any one question I ask you, no matter what it is. Are you ready? You of all people should be ashamed of yourself for fighting me. You are me. in my way. I don't want to fight you, Katomi. We can work through this. Take. <laughs> 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 I decided to fight or not. Ash, well, <laughs> here we go. No triple barrier hurting me. No stop. <laughs> Schedule to fight you. Show some appreciation. Anymore. Please, let's just stop this. Remember anything now? You can't still be drawing a blank. Remember, damn it! I don't. I'm sorry. Well, I'm sure you remember our deal. If I won, you were supposed to answer any one question I had. So, my question is... What the hell happened to you after the events in your diary? Just remember, damn it! 
It would be too convenient for you to just forget. This isn't some sort of soap opera. This is real life. I'm really sorry. You honestly can't remember, huh? Hey, Reiji, you know of any ways to jog her memory? What do I look like, a brain surgeon? I have no idea. Which means Saki's memories stop right before she leaves us. Still, she remembers you guys, right? That's good, isn't it? It's terrible! Ko... I can't possibly forgive her! And yet, I also can't hold a grudge against someone who's... who's not all there! Hell do you mean by that? Children should be seen and not heard. You wanna go? Come on, just cut it out already. So, you're willing to accept her the way she is? Even as a proven turncoat? Well... I'm really sorry. I don't know how many times I can tell you that. But it seems like I can't be with you anymore. So I guess this is goodbye again. Saki? Wait. Uh... Who are you again? Looks like you've cheered up a little. Why are you here, Aoi? Boss wanted me to give you this, Asahi. Wait, is that...? He said if you needed to, you were more than welcome to make use of it. I think I have to be going now. Bye-bye. Hey, Tachibana. What is that? The Freedom Fighter's Activity Log. Doll Delusion has been safely destroyed, but there's a girl who's in a bad place now. Her name is Saki Hoshi, one of our rivals. She's gone off to sulk in a far-off corner of Akihabara, and despite our history, she's made no moves against us. I can't ignore the suffering of any resident of Akihabara, so I've decided to extend an olive branch. And when I did, this is what she said. There's only one world, isn't there? What do you mean by that? The world I was trying to protect isn't a happy one, according to that girl. Actually, I don't think the world is my problem here. The problem is, I've been doing all this for selfish reasons. Protecting the world for glory, not because I care about the people in it. What? You think you're a hypocrite now? Protecting the world's heavy stuff. Tough to wrap your head around. There ain't just one world. Hell, depending on how you look at it, there's as many worlds as there are people. It's all about your point of view. Just like you guys and us. How so? We're both doing what we gotta do to destroy delusions, right? Both basically after the same thing. But even if our goals are aligned, we can't work together as the worlds we see are so dang different. We're basically flying the same flag in clashing colors. Our worlds are the only thing that make us incompatible. A girl looking to destroy delusions and one who don't want her delusion taken away just ain't seeing the same world. So what do I do about that? Surrender to us. Excuse me? Take some time and get to know us. Learn how we think, so you can see the same world we do, and we can see eye to eye. And maybe, one day, we'll get to see the world that girl with the wild way of thinking dreams about. After our discussion, she agreed to join the Akihabara Freedom Fighters. And also, she could try to understand the world that girl, Katomi Sonata, lived in. Wait, so you... All for Ko. I'm sorry. Kotomi, I'm really sorry. A little late for apologies now. Always so selfish and prideful. But then you go and do something like that. How's a girl supposed to hold a grudge? I know it's too late to apologize, and what's done can't be undone. But still, I really am sorry. Damn it. This is so not like you. It's weird. I take back my one question condition. I want you to promise me one more thing. From now on, you are not to apologize to me ever again. You got that? I'm... Damn it all, just stop! Stop! 
doing that! I'll make it nice and clear for you. No matter what you say, I will not ever forgive you! Understood? Wait, do you mean that, Ko? You know, Sonata, Hoshino really seems genuine about being sorry. You shouldn't be so hard on her. Nobody asked you! Don't worry about those two, Yamato. I think they'll be just fine. <sighs> Whatever then. Saki, I will never forgive you. Not ever. Fine. So until I do, I want you to stay with me. And teach me about your world. What are you... Sounds like a pretty good offer to me, Saki. Ryu... God, can't you just be honest with yourselves? Yamato... Don't misunderstand me. It's not like I can't revenge all I want against you just because we're working together. You see? Yeah, I guess you're right. I guess I'll just have to be prepared to be, uh, revenged upon. But, well, if it's you doing the revenging, Kotomi, I think that'll be just fine. <laughs> That's so cruel! Saki, how could you choose Kotomi over little old me? p pin -kun? With that all settled, let's say we get out of here. I'll treat you guys to some food, since it is a special occasion. Hey, why are you acting all adult all of a sudden? Because I am an adult? Well then, let's get some yakiniku at the most expensive restaurant in town. Only if you order nothing but Grady Kalbi. Katomi? What is it? I really am sorry, you know. But I'm also grateful. So thank you. I have no idea what you're talking about. But I will say, your delusion wasn't bad. to say, I'm glad Ko had that diary on hand. Yeah, good thing it was written in such careful detail, too. That's what saved the day, I think. We should make sure to send our thanks along to Boss and his Freedom Fighters, too. Couldn't have done it without them. Bet you're happy now, huh, little lady? About what, exactly? Uh, hey, I was talking to her, not you. What? Hmm? Whose phone was that? Mine. From the boss. The Freedom Fighters? What? What is this all about? What's it say? If you don't remember my actual name, you can just delete this message. But if you do remember my name, I want you to stay away from the Freedom Fighters HQ. We are currently embroiled in battle with the DAB. What? So that's what they were up to, huh? Why would the DAB attack the Freedom Fighters? You're forgetting what the DAB's primary goal is. They exist to manage the delusions, to take ownership of them. So when there's a group that's destroying everyone they can find... Yeah. They're moving to squash the Freedom Fighters and get them out of their way. Will they be alright? I don't know. This is the only contact I have with them anymore. What are we gonna do then? Just leave them be? Ko, what do you think we should do? <laughs> it's your decision, not mine. Thank you, Ko. All right, people, let's mobilize and save all the Freedom Fighters! What's going on? I don't see DAB agents anywhere. Maybe not, but look close and you can see traces of battle. They're in here somewhere. Boss, Misuki, Akari, Aoi, I hope they're all okay. Even if they are. It's my turn to show those agents who the real boss is. Not the time for jokes, Sonata. Ugh, killjoy. I think I see what's going on. What is it? What? 
You starting to lose your nerve or something? Hell no. I was just thinking this delusion's got some real cohesion to it. Unlike a certain Chuny Bratz. <laughs> Who are you even comparing me to? Whose delusion is this? Figure it out before we get to the core of this place, and I'll treat you to a delectable sirloin. I'm holding you to that, damn it. Still no sign of the Freedom Fighters or the DAB. No resistance at all. Um, Reiji? Yeah? I think I've got it figured out now. Is this where...? Can't say for sure, but yeah. I think you're on the right track. Hmm? What right track? What are you guys talking about? Nothing. Come on, we've got to keep moving. They're probably fighting right in the core of this place. Yeah, you're right. Let's go! I just hope they're all okay. Shall we proceed through the door? I will have... Ha! Thought maybe the reinforcements were here, but it's just you guys. <laughs> yoo -hoo! Hello. Nice to see you guys more intact than we expected. Ha! <laughs> of course we are! Those wimps were no match for the Freedom Fighters! We all banded together and hit them with a BAM! And with a kapow! And they were donezo! The suits ran away before you got here. They were probably just grunts. I doubt they'll be the last. That's not a judgment, though. You guys did good, so we should get the hell out of here while we still can. Why? What could they have that'd chase us off? No matter how strong you are, they have a nearly limitless supply of reinforcements at their disposal. They won't stop till they make you disappear. What do you mean, disappear? <laughs> He's just exaggerating. If I had time to joke around, I wouldn't have come all this way. The Delusory Administration Bureau is not an opponent a ragtag bunch like us can take on and actually hope to beat. Well, thanks for the warning, but we ain't an easy group to snuff out ourselves. We're like noble cockroaches. Boss! Whoa! Saki Saki, is that you? Looks like her. Remember now, do you, Saki? Now that I've knocked some sense into her, she does. And given that Katomi's next to you, it looks like you finally managed to bury the hatchet. Not bad. Boss. Boss, what are you talking about? Uh, let's just say that's classified. Need to know basis only. Sorry. Thank you, boss. Where do you get off thanking me? You were a spy for your gang from the start anyway, weren't you? Huh. <laughs> Not likely. You'll have to think of a better line than that. I'd like to express my gratitude as well, boss. Thank you. You lose a few of your marbles on the way here or something? I'm your sworn enemy, remember? Don't be thanking me! Yeah, I guess we are enemies. Or we were, anyway, but I don't want to fight with you for another minute. You don't get to make that decision. Mizuki. Don't you think the time has come to quit the Akihabara Freedom Fighters and come with us? Please? I'd like you to do that too. <sighs> I guess I would too. If you stay with them, the DAB will destroy you. And I should be the only one who gets to destroy you. Speaking of, we should leave. Like now. Please, come with us. What do you say, Mizuki? You found yourself a pretty great group of friends, Asahi. But so have I. Oh, you mean us? You're making me blush. Now that's why you're my right-hand man. If they're really that precious to you, then you should know I'm serious. Put a stop to the Freedom Fighters. Join us. <sighs> well, how's about you make him quit? By force, I mean. What? Why? Fighting is in our very name, Asahi. It's our raison d'etre. But if you beat us, then we'll disband the Akihabara Freedom Fighters. I give you my word on that. Are you serious? 
dead serious, Mizuki. But if we win, every last one of you's got to surrender to us. Our victory, our terms. Well, aren't you a gambler? Tch, a decisive battle, huh? Uh, I'm fine with this. As long as we do not lose. You guys... We're not going easy on you, you know. We'll give it everything we've got. Our righteousness versus your righteousness in a knockdown, drag out brawl. Let's see whose righteousness is left. Only thing I know for sure is that we can't walk the same path. We're too different for that. I'll be your opponent, Asahi. If that's what you want, Mizuki, let's end this here and now. We solemnly swear to fight with every last ounce of strength we have. Right, guys? Let's show them what for. Let's do this, everyone. Come, Come on, now, you and me, let's end Turns out we got the right
come. Now let's do the bumper right away. Get under. I have to see this through no matter what. Someone's 
Peter's filled the first. Nothing is impossible. This seems pretty cool. Am I shimmering? Nothing to it. Somebody let me. As it should be. Nothing to it. Now I can just. Yes, I'm still growing after. We win. This isn't over. We've still got a chance to turn this around. Like a snowball in hell, I'm at my limit. Come on, you two. Mizuki. Boss? We lost. What? Why? I can still fight? Really? Now? Finally time for the boss of this delusion to show its face. You're kidding me! So it really is true. What is? What's going on? That's what I'd like to know. Hmm. So that's how it's gonna be, huh? Boss? What's happening? Mizuki, you said you can still fight, didn't you? Yes, that's right. But why? Consider this an order from your boss. You're gonna team up with Asahi and his buds and beat the monster in the back room. What? Boss? Can you hear me? Loud and clear. Hey! Open up! Why are you doing this? The heck is that anyway? And what does he mean, beat it? That monster's been a thorn in our side for years now. That's why we sealed off the room. You just sealed your problem away? Asahi, can you hear me? Yeah, I can, but only just. So open the freaking door and I'll be able to hear you better. Nothing doing. Consider this a request from me personally, Asahi. And Akari, and Aoi too. Beat that thing. Please. Seriously, why and how? Yo, boss. You okay not telling these kids the truth? The only thing I hate more than lying is liars. Is now really the time to put on airs? Come on, Asahi. Let's give it everything we've got and smash this thing into the ground. I can handle it on my own. You don't touch it. Why not? Because you'll hesitate. And if you stop to regret things, you're gonna miss your moment. I see him! Whoa. Is this our monster? Let's take this thing down. For the Freedom Fighters!
That was close. We did it. More like we've gone and done it. Huh? What are you talking about? Wait, did we do something wrong? You could say that. Nice work. Huh? Why? What the hell is happening here? Wait! <laughs> Just what it looks like, Mizuki. Seriously? Seriously. But why? Why are you disappearing? This can't be. Asahi, it's been one hell of a ride since we met, ain't it? Boss? <gasps> Guess these hands ain't gonna be able to protect the future of Akihabara no more, huh? That's why I'm leaving it up to you. Wait! And don't try giving me them puppy dog eyes. So are you saying... Man, I wanted to play with you guys a little bit longer. <laughs> me too. <laughs> Is this some kind of sick joke? At least, let me take my revenge first. Please, boss. Tell me. What's really going on here? Tell me! Mizuki, we wouldn't have met if it weren't for you. Boss? But where there's a meeting, there's also bound to be a parting. It doesn't have to be. Not now! You know, you're pretty lucky to have such great friends. But why? Why do you have to go? 
He made things pretty fun for me, too. Every day, something different. Much obliged, Mizuki. Same here! Mizuki, and thanks to you, I was able to have lots and lots and lots of fun! Thank you! Thank you, sub-boss. Wait! Asahi, I got one more request for you, if you don't mind. What is it? Take care of Mizuki. That's your job! Well, time for us to get going. Mizuki, take care. Goodbye! So long! So long. With that, I hereby decree the Akihabara Freedom Fighters dismissed! Dismissed! In the end, there never was an Akihabara of Freedom Fighters. It didn't exist from the start. Nothing more than my delusions. It was only then that I realized the humbling power delusions have. To rob someone of their ability to distinguish fantasy from reality. Someone who's been by my side as long as I remember could turn out to be the product of someone's imagination and places I've known my whole life could just be dreams. But in my world, they're all real. And I'll never forget them. I promise. The Akihabara Freedom Fighters and the joy of the time I spent with them will never, ever be forgotten.